All right, well, CBS continues to pump out its original Christmas movies this year, and we're really here for it. We are. We are loving we really these. Are. And this Sunday, the latest film, When Christmas Was Young, tells the story of a headstrong music manager and a gifted singer-songwriter who together put up a fight to reclaim mm -hmm. the rights to her Christmas song. And here to tell us more about this story is leading lady Karen David. Welcome, Karen, to Great Day Washington. Good morning. Uh, good morning, Ellen and Kristen. Thank you so much for having me. I feel, are you living in like a Christmas bubble right now, getting to talk about <laughs> your movie over and over? I mean, it's a tough life, right? <laughs> uh, things you do to pay the bills. <laughs> what it's is, been what, so magical. Oh, what is this one all about? Because you yourself are a singer-songwriter, right? This has to be a natural yeah. fit. You know, this role was such a dream come true because it just took me back to my music roots. And I know for Tyler, it's the same, too. Um, we have so much in common, you know, with swapping stories about uh, the start and the beginning of our journeys and what that was like going through the ups and downs and the twists and turns of um, pursuing our dreams um, and to, to be playing a singer songwriter. I love that this is a character that's so normal and grounded and genuine and accessible and uh, you know, she, she's a single mom who puts her family first and has made a lot of sacrifices in her life um, and doesn't even second second guess it or think anything of it because that's, that's what any parent would do uh, for the love of her family, mm. even if it means putting her childhood dreams aside. Until she meets Luke Dawson and then everything changes. Yeah, uh, naturally. You know, he's, he's that stubborn music exec that wants <laughs> to write the song because he's got his own ulterior motives too. So it's it's yeah. it's a fun dynamic between the two. And we had a lot of fun <laughs> playing playing that. We love this Christmas movie genre, the mm -hmm. two of us, and I'm sure you yeah. do too. But the ones that CBS have been putting out have been so incredible. They are a notch above. And really have enjoyed it. And yours, I mean, Cheryl Crow was an executive producer. She wrote the song that you're singing, the title <laughs> song. How cool is that? I, I, you know, it was a dream come true. I remember <laughs> being in uh, on the commuter train in London. Um, and uh, I was wearing my mask, so all you could see my, was, was my eyes, and you have all these people coming at rush hour, really tired, and a bit grumpy, and there I was when I just got the track sent to me, and I was listening, uh, listening to it, and I was just squealing, and these people in front of me were looking at me, why is she like, you could literally see my eyes smiling, I was like, Aww. <laughs> Crow singing on a demo, who's written this amazing song that's so cheerful and hopeful, as she says, and upbeat. Um, you know, you know, for my character, and I got to record the song, and it's out now on iTunes and Amazon and uh, Spotify. So uh, it's it's just been a dream come true to just circle back to my music roots, and then on top of that, getting to work with Tyler Hilton and our amazing cast and our director Monica Mitchell, who's just a force of nature. And Robert really wrote such a genuine and grounded um, film, and uh, I hope that resonates to uh, everyone that watches. I also saw your husband as a producer as well for this project. So if we had yes. more time, I'd ask you how that really was. <laughs> <laughs> it was, it was, you know, it's, it's always tough because you're like, you don't want to make assumptions, you know, because he's, he's a busy songwriter producer. And I was like, bye. <laughs> <laughs> and then, of course, I mean, he's a huge fan of Cheryl's as well. Yeah. So, um, you know, it, it was, it, I'm glad that, you know, I, at this point, you know, he's a Grammy nominated singer, so, uh, songwriter, producer, but I never yeah. take that for granted. So I'm just like, can you fit me in? That's so sweet. <laughs> so and, he said yes. nice. and he said yes. <laughs> Good uh, Karen, congrats. Yes, we can't wait to see the movie. Yes. Thank you so much. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Again, you can watch When Christmas Was Young with Karen David on Sunday, December 18th at 8 p.m. right here on WUSA 9.